Hello my learner, I am teacher Jonathan. This is Easy Limu Learning Simplified. Welcome. In our grade 4 Science and Technology on Human Body today, we look at types of teeth. And in our pairs, can you observe teeth in, your, in the mouth of your partner and tell me what you can see inside. Inside the mouth, there are teeth. That is correct. But John, do the teeth have the same shape? Do they have the same shape? The teeth that you've seen in your partner, ah, they are not of the same shape. And you, Wangare, does the number of the teeth in the mouth of your partner are the same as the one you have? The number of teeth, they are not the same. So we say, we say this, teeth in our mouth are of different shapes. Teeth in our mouth, in our mouth are of different shape, are of different, are of different shapes. Even number, they are not of the same number, they are different. Shape and number are of different. Point number two, we say the teeth that you've seen, if you have grown to a grown up person like your teacher today, a fully grown person has that two teeth. A fully grown person. A fully grown person has 32 teeth. If you are fully grown, you will have 32 teeth. Can you count the number of teeth in the mouth of your partner? Tom, how many teeth does your partner has? They are 20, 22, 24. But when you grow to be a grown up person, you will have 32. And in the 32, we normally are say we have four types of teeth in our body. Types of teeth. We have four types of teeth. We have four types of teeth. Every human being has four types of teeth. And in our groups, can you observe the chart that we have here? Have you seen teeth of these shapes for example the teeth that you have in front here how do they look like can anybody identify them and you tell me the type of teeth that resembles the one you can see in front here millicent they are called incisors the first one we call them incisors incisors those are the first one you can see here at the lower chin and the lower gum Remember, human being has two chin, the lower one and the lower and the upper one. The lower gum and the upper gum. The lower gum has 16, the upper one has 16 to make total of that two. If that is if you have grown to be a grown, a fully grown person. And the first one we call them incisors. Can you count how many of them do you have? Incisors, how many of them do you have? A fully grown person has eight incisors. So when you will grow up, you'll have eight incisors. Then the other type of tooth, can you identify them in, our, in the mouth of your partner and tell me that those teeth you've seen, they resemble which one here? And the second type is the canine. The canine, canine is another type of teeth. Canine is another type of teeth. They look sharp pointed here. And like this other, this other looks like they are almost flat at the top. But this one, they look sharp pointed. And we say they are called canines. They will, you will find them, we will access them at the corners of your mouth. Just immediately after the incisors. Incisors are found at the front part. These ones are the incisors. But the ones towards the corner here, they are called canines. The third category, or the type of the teeth we have, is the Premolars. Premolars. 
premolars and the final category of type of teeth is the molars molars when we are learning the parts of a tooth we saw some tooth have two roots others have one root remember we said this is the gum what is inside the gum we called it a root what is this part from here downwards is called the root and the joining part here is the neck and then the part outside is the crown so we have the crown we have the neck and we have the root every tooth this is the crown this is the neck and then we have the root under the gum and premolars are the third category you'll see they have two roots unlike the others the others add one one but these others have two. They are called premolars. And the final ones, they are at the end. They are called molars and they have three roots. In our groups, have we identified that? Now you may ask, how many teeth do you have? You have 24 teeth. That is to mean not all the premolars, not all the molars are fully grown. Not all the molars are fully grown. Now, in our groups, once again, can you identify these types of teeth in your partner's mouth? After you identify our activity for today, our activity for today is we draw the four types of teeth. We draw the four types of teeth. Draw the four types of teeth. In our books, let us draw the four types of teeth. Let us draw the four types of teeth. In our books, we draw the four types of teeth. Any question from you, John and Wangare? No question. Remember, we have said a fully grown up human being always has that two teeth. And the teeth in our body, in our mouth, they are of different shape. Even the number, it is not the same. And we have four types of teeth. The incisor, we have said incisor, it's almost flat at the top, like the one you can see on our chart. The first one we've called incisor. It is almost flat at the top. The second part or the second type is the canine, which is almost sharp pointed. The third one is the premolar and the molar. Both have two and three roots respectively. Any question, when you go home kindly, observe the teeth of your younger brother, of your younger sister, and make sure you know how many teeth does your younger brother has. And that marks the end of our lesson for today. Have a nice time. Kwaerini.